All right, what's up everybody? I got a new knife, baby. New year, 2022, new knife. Look at this, forged by the same steel they used to make the katana 400 years ago. This is Damascus, hand pounded, hand decorated by the gods themselves. That's what it looks like. Look at this masterpiece. You wanna focus on that? You wanna focus on that, that beauty? Are you seeing that? Oh, you can't, it's not, it's not, fo it's not focusing. All right, that's okay. I'll I'll do a B roll later. That's that's okay. We'll do a B roll later. We'll get a we'll get a B roll footage in there later. Don't worry about it. So what's the best way? Okay, are you getting me? All right. So what's the best way to test the new knife? You might be saying, "Oh, cut some beef." This is, as they say, a gyu tol here in China, and that what does that mean? That means beef knife. This is specifically designed for cutting beef. Well, I already did that, made myself a nice finely diced French tartare, smooth as expected. However, there is one other meat that is far, don't, what are you doing with the camera? You gotta hold the camera still, okay? I don't wanna give people autism, okay? There is one meat that I think is the most difficult to cut and it will be the greatest test for the sharpness of this knife. And what's that? It is the head of an octopus. The raw head of an octopus. All right, so that's what we're gonna do here. This is raw. If you cook octopus, of course, it becomes a lot easier to cut. But this is the raw head of an octopus because I like it raw, baby. I like it raw, baby. Everybody likes it raw out here. Usually they boil the the legs and stuff of the octopus, but the head, you eat that shit raw, buddy, because the uh, the texture is phenomenal. And that texture, while it is delicious in your mouth, oh, look at that. While it is delicious in your mouth, it does a number on the average kitchen knife. Let me do a little comparison, actually. Should I cut with a kitchen knife first? Here's a regular kitchen knife. Regular kitchen knife, just to show you what we're working with. Look how difficult this is. It's all wiggly and wiggly with the with the skin, right? It's hard to penetrate. I made a little bit of a cut there. If I really press hard, okay, we're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere, but man, that was very difficult to cut. Honestly, not as hard as last time. The last time I got octopus head, there was more of this like goopy layer. Do you see this? There's like a goopy layer between the skin and the meat. And that goopy layer is not very consistent from octopus to octopus, so sometimes it's a lot more difficult. But for now, okay, this was not actually that difficult. Um, you know, I could, I could possibly, I could do it with this knife. But anyway, enough about that. We're gonna try the katana knife here. Oh man, look at that. Oh, oh, oh. stop moving the camera like that. You're gonna give people, you know, Down syndrome if you keep moving the camera like that. Okay, I don't want to cause any sort of, some sort of irreparable harm to my audience. Okay. We're gonna, oh, you wanna try some octopus? Is that what you want? Okay, hold on. How's that? You like, you like that? Oh, okay. Still a little bit of, what? You, you missed it? Oh my god, you missed, oh, okay. That's what you, that's what you mean. okay, that's okay. Anyway, a little bit of resistance as expected from this gelatinous skin, but, bam, very smooth. Very smooth slices, that's what I want. I want thin slices, I do not like thick slices of octopus head. I'll tell you. Beautiful. Oh yeah, she can't even contain her excitement. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. What if I do it the other way? Let's try from here. Might be a lot easier. Oh yeah, that's that's better. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yes, baby. Smooth, baby. Oh yeah. Oh, these are a little bit connected. That's okay. That's okay. You didn't see nothing. All right. Oh yeah. Let's keep it going. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> the head of the octopus. Oh my gosh, can't contain her excitement. Oh yeah, you love it. You know you love it. You love to see it. You love to see it. Oh, one clean stroke. See that one clean stroke. Oh, one clean stroke. Oh, that was a little, that was back and that's a little back and forth. That's okay. Let me try one clean stroke. In. Oh, okay. This is tough. 
Oh yeah, one clean stroke, baby. Clean stroke. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. Clean stroke. Clean stroke, baby. Oh, what's this? There's a little bit of a fucking bone in here. Are they trying to fucking kill me? These Japanese. Pearl Harbor wasn't enough? Look at this. What the fuck is that? I didn't even know octopus had bones. That's a fucking bone. Hmm. What is this? Are they trying to fucking kill me, these Japanese? What is this? Because I'm an American? They put a fucking bone in my octopus? What is this shit? I didn't even know octopus had bones. What the fuck is this? I didn't know. What the hell? What the fuck is this? It's like plastic? I've never seen it before in my life. What the fuck is this? Holy shit. Well, I know a squid has like a little feather inside, but this is not a squid. It's in the fucking octopus. What the hell was that? Don't argue with me on camera, okay? <laughs> Let me express my disappointment and surprise. Oh yeah, you can see you can see what I'm talking about though. See that see that mucusy layer? There's that mucusy layer. It's not consistent throughout. Oh uh, yeah, she said it looks delicious. Alright. Well. Um, I'll stick to the other half of the head. I did not have that layer. But anyway, that's when it gets really tough to cut cleanly, but as you can see, we are having minimal resistance, baby. Boom. That mucusy layer. We are cutting through it like butter. We could even start on the top. Oh, no, we can't. I guess it was better flipped over because I could press it down. Sort of line it up right. There we go. Because you want to have that mucusy skin along with the meat in every mouth. Oh, my God. There's a lot, of, a lot of mucus there. And you might be asking yourself, why the hell are you eating this? But, uh, hey. When you went in Rome, do as the Romans do. You know what they say. Actually, this is not a popular food in Japan. This is not that commonly eaten. They don't eat this at all in Tokyo. This is something that we do up here in the north, baby. So, I just do it because I like it. Boom. Look at that. Boom. Oh, yeah. Boom. Beautiful. Beautiful diced head of an octopus. Not paper thin, but that's as thin as you're gonna get basically with the head of an octopus. You wanna get a little taste test? Tastes like strawberry ice cream. A little bit of vanilla. A little bit of clam chowder. I'm getting a hint of rosemary. I'm getting some chicken alfredo. There's lots of different flavors up in there. Really complex. And it's delicious. Love it. Love it. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Alright. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was my new knife. Happy New Year. New knife, new year. It's a new me, baby. Oh, don't get scared now. Don't get scared.